Hello guys, welcome back. In today's video, let us see how to make homemade ghee. No introduction is needed for this golden liquid when it comes to Indian cooking. We almost use it every day. Now let us see how to prepare homemade ghee from butter. Let's get started. In a heavy bottomed kadai, add in the butter. You can use either homemade butter or store bought butter also. Slowly the butter will start to melt. Keep cooking in a medium flame. Stir now and then and continue cooking until all the butter is melted completely. I have already uploaded how to make butter in home. Check the description box for the link or I will link in the i card above. Now the butter is almost melted. At this stage it forms a white cloudy layer on the top. Keep mixing and continue to cook. As we all know food plays an important role in Indian festivals. Without any doubt, we make a lot of sweets and ghee is therefore unavoidable during festival. So try to make some ghee at home and enjoy the delicious foods. So coming back to our ghee, the white layer slowly starts to discard and if you keep stirring, the layer gets slowly disappear. So be patient and keep cooking in a medium flame. The entire process takes close to 20 to 30 minutes depending upon the amount of butter we use slowly it will start to get clear so continue cooking the butter which i made at home is by collecting the malai from the milk there are many ways to make butter at home but i feel preparing from malai is the easiest and simplest one all you need to do is to boil the milk so after boiling the milk let allow the milk to cool down slowly you, see, you get to see the layers of malai over the milk so keep collecting that so once you get a good amount of uh, malai you can start preparing the butter and from the butter we can prepare the ghee preparing ghee from malai is very pocket friendly you don't get to spend anything just collect the malai and prepare the homemade ghee and butter Okay, if you see the ghee now, the cloudy layer has almost discarded and slowly you get to see the pure golden ghee. Keep mixing lightly so that the residues settle down in the bottom. So once everything settles down in the bottom and the top portion of the ghee is very clear, you can add few curry leaves or moringa leaves for flavor. I didn't have moringa leaves with me right now, so I added some curry leaves. The curry leaves mixes with the ghee and gives a very nice flavor, so please don't skip this step. Now the ghee is very clear, so right now you can switch off and allow the ghee to cool down a little. If you see the bottom part of the kadai right now, the residue will be settled right now. See it is very dark inside. So that is also edible. You can mix that and have along it with rice. Now the ghee has almost cooled down. So strain it with a metal strainer to remove the impurities. Please do not use a plastic one because the ghee will be very hot, hot at right now. So it is. let us not take any chance. Our golden liquid is almost ready now. See how beautiful it is. Pure golden ghee and homemade flavorful ghee is ready right now. Use the homemade ghee with variety of parathas, dosas and sweets and enjoy with your family. If you like this video, please don't forget to give a thumbs up, comment and subscribe to our channel. For more such interesting recipes, please visit my website www.happytrayer.com. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye-bye.